Once you bring life into the world, you must protect it. We must protect it by changing the world. Quote of the day. Let's get right to Bitcoin on the BLX chart. We are going to look at the three month, the six month, and the 12 month charts. Not often do we do this, but it's important because all three closed just a few days ago, right? So let's get right to it. BLX, going all the way back, Bitcoin's history. We have all our moving averages here. Do we see anything special or different on the three month? Well, not a whole lot is going on. So we will look at more specifically the six month and the 12 month could be interesting, but we just closed our most recent candle right at the EMA 34. So that is showing support so far. Doesn't mean it can't be broken, but what do we notice? Look at how four three month candles in a row after a gravestone doji candle printed back in 2021, towards the end of 2021, right? This is October, November, December of 2021. Gravestone Doji, followed by four consecutive red bearish candles. So far, slightly green. We will see how the first quarter goes. That's what these are, quarterly candles. So that is the three month. Now, how about we zoom out even bigger to the six month candles and see if we see anything special happening there. Here is a full snapshot of Bitcoin going all the way back, noting all basically up movements, right? Uh, we can have up and downs, and we've had three reds in a row there, two reds, three, right? And now we're in our two. Again, uh, two consecutive six-month candles. That's a year of drawdown for you mathematicians. And we will see, will we end up going down to, say, the EMA 21, currently around 11, just, just shy of 12K, Right, that is a lot of support on the maybe you've seen on the weekly charts, the monthly charts. So support between 14, 12, 10k, something in there. This would kind of coincide with that. If we move down further, uh, you can see uh, another not great looking candle right here, going all the way back to early 2021, uh, and then followed by an indecision candle right here. Right, look at the bulls and bears fighting. Right, notice the wicks on both sides. Followed by bullish and bearish engulfing candle, excuse me, and another six month candle followed right up after. So that's our six month chart. Now, how about we zoom out to annual candles? So each candle you see here, you guessed it, one year. Now we have it on the BLX chart so you can get all of the history, right? So this is since Bitcoin's inception, obviously massive catapult up early on. And now we are, for the first time, really closing at or slightly under our EMA eight year, uh, eight, just think of that eight year moving average, right? Eight year moving average is right there in red. We closed just under it. Uh, where was it? It was about 17 K I believe. Let's get an exact number. So that number was just, just North of 17, 17 zero 99 is our EMA eight year moving average. And where did we happen to close? We closed at 16 five for the year. So what does that mean? Well, this is a bearish engulfing candle, which we have not done in Bitcoin's history. So if you're, if you're going to say this time is different, well, there's the facts. This time is different. What does that mean? Are we going to go down continue? Well, that would be the odds, but you know, there's nothing certain in crypto, right? There's nothing certain in anything in life. Uh, but you know, a bearish engulfing candle is obviously more bearish than not. Uh, they do not always work out. They do not work out, you know, much more than half of the time. Okay. So don't panic, but certainly worth noting that a bearish engulfing candle on the yearly is, is a little bit concerning, right? And that is probably the reason why for the first time ever, we have a weekly chart showing <laughs> if we load, uh, watch this, right? The, for the first time ever, I mean, look at the 200 week, right? That is a bad line to be going down. We have never gone down on the 200 week EMA. That is another cause for concern and likely the reason, right? A year with a bearish engulfing candle on a yearly chart. So uh, until that turns around, right? We have to close above the EMA eight on the weekly, the EMA 14 on the weekly. We have not done since our rally last Spring, right? Plain and simple. That's Bitcoin on the biggest charts summarized by the coolest guy on the internet. <laughs>
Uh, so you got a uh, quote of the day. Uh, hopefully you like that. There you go. Uh, car of the day. Uh, we're going to go with a Pagani Zanda. Uh, excuse me. Pagani Waira. Mispronounced. And this is, yes, this is that big. So here's my face. It's one twelfth scale. I got this for Christmas as well. Yes, I just asked for model cars for Christmas because I'm 12 again. <laughs> But pretty cool, very detailed, real carbon fiber, um, real like suede and leather and the wheels and the brakes. So Pagani Waira, the doors go up and down, the flaps in the front go up and down. I mean, it's 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 nutty how detailed these things get when you get to um, this kind of scale. But that's 112th Pagani Waira. All right, I'll see you on the next one.